Hi guys and welcome. If you want to start your own business on Shopify, definitely this video can be handy for you because in this video I want to highlight all the main issues and all the main knowledges that you need to know and to use to start your own business in Shopify. Um, I saw all those one hour long videos about how to start in Shopify and I don't want to waste your time. That's why um, I'll try to make this video as short as possible and with maximum value for you. Uh, before I've started, I want to say that our team left the link in the description panel of this video. This link is referral and um, it would be great if you uh, will use this link considering this video as useful. Uh, so you can easily find the link, you can easily jump to Shopify, uh, start page and uh, first thing that you need to do is start a free trial. Uh, first of all, you need to provide the platform with the uh, email address, password and your store name. To mention that this store name can be really uh, difficult stuff to create because all of the names like good store, nice shop, best shop, best store already available for sure uh, and uh, they already exist and you cannot make the same name. So you need to create your own unique name for your uh, online store. I will not show you all the process of the registration because it's very easy and fast. It's uh, up to three minutes uh, definitely and the platform itself will ask you uh, you creating your uh, web page for yourself or for someone for maybe for your client you selling goods um, already or you're just starting to you have an idea of business or you're just um, surfing internet and and so on i will not show it to you so let's jump straight to dashboard let's jump straight to inside and i'm going to show you uh, all the things that you need to make and to use all the buttons all the features that you will use to set up your first web store in uh, on, on the Shopify. That's how the platform looks from inside. You have all the home orders, products, customers, analytics, marketing, discount, apps and online store. Uh, as I told you previously, I created this account to show you which steps do you need to pass uh, from the ground from absolute zero to set up uh, your first or maybe not the first but but from the zero you need to build your own web store from the zero uh, I have eight days left of my trial version uh, and first thing that you need to do the platform thinks that first thing that you need to do is a select a plan we will not select a plan for this case definitely you need uh, to select a plan let's just discover what are those and those are basic Shopify Shopify and advanced Shopify is only three of them it's 29 per month 79 per month and 299 per month and it depends uh, the transaction fee depends on which plan you're gonna use it's 2% transaction fee on the basic 1% transaction fee on the recommended Shopify like standard one and advanced Shopify is 0.5% transaction fee and it really depends on how many things you will sell uh, and uh, I suggest you to pick uh, that plan that will suit to your business for now so if you're planning to sell a lot uh, don't use the 299 per month because uh, you can use this money um, more efficiently than to buy a uh, advanced Shopify that you will never use in maybe in one year or, or two years yeah so let, let's start step by step uh, home this is the page that you can see and there's a three steps that you need to make to actually launch your uh, your website add a product customize theme and add a domain we're gonna talk about all of this just in seconds after I'll uh, show you all the buttons turn international traffic into sales you can set up all the things uh, how to set up things you can get um, uh, the tutorials and you can get explore uh, you can explore a YouTube channel of Shopify uh, there's a lot of interesting and really useful in educational materials here on the platform and I will show it to you also while we're gonna discover all the pages uh, just learn more yeah why Shopify how Shopify Shopify is one of the biggest 
and platforms in the world and everybody knows that and a lot of people using that platform because it's really convenient and it's really powerful uh, to buy and to sell actually uh, so home you saw the home orders now here in the orders um, you'll see all the things connected to orders all the payments um, but of course you need to select a plan yeah drafts uh, and abundant checkouts all the things uh, connected to the sales will be here products here's a spot where you need to add a product find your own products uh, you can take care about inventory uh, and uh, all the things tracking your products adding you adjust the rate counts and so so on and so on transfers if you have some uh, incoming inventory to your uh, store to your warehouse uh, this can be handy collections this is very important very um, interesting and powerful tool of sales when you have a lot of items to sell uh, you can make the collections um, i don't know for example you selling like t-shirt and short um, and I don't know some tie maybe yeah this collection and here you go you can sell it gift cards gift cards you can add a gift card product and uh, uh, it can be sold or you can make it as a really gift customers all the information about your um, your physical customers who ordered something and who made a purchases from your site and all the purchase history will be available here analytics really big really macro um, if you want to run your business efficiently definitely you need to know all the analytics stuff total sales and line store sessions returning customer rate and and so on and so on a lot of information that can be useful to run your business as efficiently as possible reports also uh, with a sales live view we don't need it for the moment because it's totally blank and there's no uh, um, there's no sales at all on this account marketing marketing overview and there's a couple interesting things just wait for it there's a couple interesting things uh, you see you can paint templates there are like promotions that are already pre-built multi-channel campaigns uh, you see launch a one-click multi-channel campaign grow your audience promote sales events, showcase new products across channels uh, templates make it easy with the recommended sales channels pre-filled content and scheduling so this is really powerful tool uh, to bring new customers to your business um, and one interesting thing those marketing apps uh, you can switch on the marketing apps you can set up an app an external app like snapchat ads sms bump marketing uh, some tools for email marketing and uh, it will bring your business to level up for sure to another level definitely because uh, all those campaigns are pretty cool and you can uh, view campaign templates and and create a campaigns and so on and you'll see all the campaigns uh, straight here and all the automation and when we're talking about the automation you see we're talking about the applications also uh, because automation is actually uh, what lets you sleep while your online market is working for you and generating income okay discounts uh, everything is clear with discounts and apps applications there's uh, even separate button for applications and you can use application for design planning shipping and bookkeeping and if you're gonna visit the Shopify App Store you'll be surprised that there are tons of interesting and very very useful tools some uh, of them are for free and some of them you need to buy but um, in the long run definitely you can uh, upgrade your business with all those apps uh, I showed you all the main things let's jump to online store and that's what you what you're probably waiting for uh, online store is password protected of course because you need to select a plan uh, and uh, if you want to disable the password you'll go to preferences and if we uh, if we're already here uh, so password protection pick a plan okay it's understandable and pretty clear uh, so preferences title and meta description this is the spot where you need to type in your uh, your business name 
your brand name and you need to enter the description of your business uh, and that's very important because search engines um, need to find you okay you need to be visible to search engines so you need to use um, as specific keywords as possible to describe your business uh, as better as possible social sharing image understandable if you want to share your uh, link to your website to some Facebook maybe or Pinterest or some else place uh, you need to add an image for social sharing because uh, it's not the same as you will use on your main layout of your website Google Analytics if you want to use uh, more analytics than provides uh, with the uh, platform itself here in analytics definitely you need to use the google analytics uh, and you can switch it on here facebook pixel also customer privacy limits 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 password protection i showed you spam protection domains uh, if you have a um, custom domain that's pretty cool because you see tons of goods here dot my shopify.com and maybe slash 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 that's not that's not professional actually you need to have the as short as possible domain name and um, this domain name should describe your business as much uh, as it possible and so on and so on and you can buy new domains straight from here you can transfer domain or connect existing domain if you own one for example navigation uh, we're gonna jump to themes we're gonna jump to editor and I'll show you the navigation and here you can edit the navigation the footer menu and main menu now uh, you can add it here pages you can add or delete pages to your online store uh, the same with the blog post um, and themes so the first thing that you need to know that a lot of people making the same mistake in this spot using the default theme uh, of Shopify and this is pretty understandable for those people who are using Shopify that you are using the default theme and it's not so professional let's say like that so you need to uh, discover the theme library and there are a lot of interesting projects that you can use for your business and it's already pre-built and it's already pre-made but actually it matters but on this step it doesn't matter because uh, all the editing features are pretty the same and I want to show it to you uh, this editor is not the same with um, um, similar website building platforms because um, in all of those platforms in general in most cases is drag and drop features everywhere and it's very and very cool but here uh, you cannot edit text with a double click you cannot edit the uh, uh, background image with a double click you cannot edit everything with a double click everything is happening with this left hand menu and you see the layout is pretty classical yeah it's a header image image text featured collections image with a text overlay testimonials gallery and a footer uh, this is the default theme and, and uh, as I told you already you can use other theme uh, but you can add a section from this spot with this button maybe you need the collection list or you need the gallery or you need the product or you need the promotional newsletter or maybe you have a physical store at some address and you need to switch on the map and so on uh, if you need to move things around you just grabbing um, grabbing this spot this section with the six uh, things six dot buttons and and just moving them around in the order that you want uh, if you want to delete some uh, some spot that you don't need for example testimonials I don't need them here I can remove this section down here uh, in this block if you need to uh, take care about each section you need to jump into the section itself and you have all the settings here uh, like image alignment layout section 8 text size heading and and the text is changing uh, right here right in this spot and that's pretty interesting and unusual but 
actually you can use that that also and you can build beautiful website and professional looking website with this thing if you don't have your own content you can use uh beautiful gallery and free images there are tons of them and they're cool quality great stock photos that you can use to build your own site uh, considering the type of your business and considering the um, industry that you're selling on it depends on the things that you're selling but um, anyway if we're gonna remove it explore free images and you see the staff fairies shop lock a lot of a lot of things that can be handy to your business like watch a stack fitness and sport and then so on uh, and really it can be handy if you don't have your own content so I showed you how to uh, how to edit all the things here and this layout is pretty pretty understandable you can use the other one uh, we jumping out of here and we go into products that's what I want to show you uh, also how to add a product you need to uh, type in the title you need to type in description with the keywords uh, for SEO all the media you can upload here pricing uh, you can sell with one of, for example 100 and here you compare at the price to 150 and this price will be crossed on the website cost per item for example if you're using uh, drop shipping or you know that you're buying for for example 27 bucks for uh, one item and it, this price is uh, 100 you see the margin you see the profit here and all the inventory all the shipping thing so you need to take care about all of these things about each item uh, you can make all this product type matter and collections you can add this to collections all the collections are here and you can um, edit them from that spot and when you're gonna be ready to uh, launch your product uh, launch your website you need to select a plan again $29 per month or $79 or $299 and you go live in Shopify you're managing the orders you're sending the items and you're getting a profit that's pretty easy that sounds easy and uh, really Shopify is one of the best platforms in the world one of the biggest uh, and really convenient and very very powerful so if you want to start your business from the ground definitely it can be handy um, I wish you good luck I hope this was useful I I tried to make this video as short as possible to just to highlight all the main things that you need to know and that you will use to start your own business in Shopify uh, there's a tons of information actually and I want to uh, remind you that in the description of this video you can find the referral link to uh, Shopify so use that link be our guest Thank you so much one more time. I wish you good profits and I wish you good luck. Thanks and bye-bye.